this tale many years ago. It is the story of a freshman just starting out at university. His parents' home was very far from the university, and so he moved to a place closer to campus, where he lived by himself. The story begins on the last day of a university festival. On that day, the student was very tired and very drunk. Because he arranged and cleaned all of the things concerning the festival, and then he drank all night long. When he came back home at around 3 a.m., he quickly went to bed. But before he could fall asleep, he heard a strange knocking from his door. Nevertheless, he was exhausted, and he regarded it as, as just a figment of his imagination. So he ignored it and went to sleep. The next day, he ate dinner with his senior and he drank a little more alcohol. He came back to his home around 10 p.m. He did some work and he washed up to go to bed. When he went to bed, he heard a knocking sound again. He felt a little strange and so he jumped out of the bed and opened the door. But there was nothing and the knocking sound was gone. Though he felt uncomfortable, he went back to bed. The next day he met his friend and told him his story. His friend advised him, don't drink any alcohol. And if the knocking sound is real, try to communicate with it. He took his advice and he went home without drinking. He went to bed and sure enough, he heard the knocking sound again without fail. He was frightened, but he remembered his friend's advice. So he tried to communicate with the knocking. If you are human, just knock two times. And if you're a ghost, just knock one time. A single rap upon the door was heard. He was very frightened, but he bravely continued. If there is one ghost, just knock one time. But if there are two ghosts, please knock two times. And then the sound changed again. 